Welcome to the Double E Cup Series Season 6 Premiere. The first race of the 10 race season is about to get underway here at the new Double E Speedway. And we got 28 drivers that are ready to get this season off and rolling. Season 5 ended more than 6 months ago. So after a little hiatus, last year's champ Dale Earnhardt Jr. is going to look to defend his title against 27 other hungry drivers. So the field will begin to roll. Let's look at our starting lineup. On the pole is Jamie McMurray with Tony Stewart. Then we have Eric Almirola in the 43 and Joey Logano in the 22, along with Jeff Gordon and Kurt Busch in row 3. In row 4, we have Hendrick teammates Dale Earnhardt Jr. and Jimmy Johnson. Then we have Gibbs teammates Matt Kenseth and Carl Edwards. And then we have Denny Hamlin and Austin Dillon along with A.J. Allmendinger making his Dex premiere, and Clint Boyer. Then we have Kevin Harvick and Casey Kane, along with Paul Menard and Danica Patrick. Then we have Casey Mears and the rookie Chase Elliott, along with Ricky Stenhouse Jr. and Kyle Larson. Then we have Brad Keselowski and Kyle Busch, along with Ryan Newman and Trevor Bain. And rounding out the field is David Reagan and Greg Biffle. Now let's get this 10 lap race started. Green flag is in the air for the Dudley Cup Series Season 6. And already Tony Stewart gives Jamie McMurray a little nudge, but he's not gonna be able to get that spot. McMurray holds him off for the lead. Some three wide already. Uh, Stewart's gonna move into second spot. Here comes Joey Logano though looking for that position as McMurray leads the first lap of the season. Logano now will take second. Stewart is third. Jeff Gordon looking for it now. Gordon is in fourth. He's gonna dive to the inside heading into three and is gonna make that pass. As up front, ooh, McMurray gets loose, grazes the wall, Logano to the lead, and we got a crash in turn four. It's Carl Edwards, Denny Hamlin, Casey Kane, and Paul Menard all are in the outside wall on lap three. As Carl Edwards making his W Cup Series premiere, it looked like AJ Elmendinger got loose, got into Hamlin, who got into Edwards, and that's the risk you take when you're in three wide, especially early on in the race like this. Elmendinger might have a tiny bit of damage, but I think he's gonna stay on the racetrack. Shouldn't be too much of an issue. But not the debut Edwards wanted for Joe Gibbs Racing in the Dudley Cup Series. Everyone else will restart on lap five. Joey Logano just took the lead, but McMurray gets a good restart. Tony, Jeff Gordon really pushing the issue here. He's going to try and take second away. He restarted third, but he's going to get loose. And now we got three wide for second place. Eric Almarola and Dale Jr. come out of nowhere. Tony Stewart stuck there on the outside, but they're going to get through four just fine. Jeff Gordon powers through the middle to third, or fourth as Joey Logano continues to lead. Now Eric Almirola gets loose off two. He collects Tony Stewart and it looked like Kurt Busch got a little bit of damage as well as now two cars are, are now wrecked on the infield on lap number six as they just got through some intense three wide racing. I don't know what happened to Almirola there. He just got really sideways, slammed into that outside wall and came right back across the 14 and the 41 looked like Busch got a little bit of damage. He got clipped ever so slightly by his teammate. He's gonna be on pit road for just a little bit of repairs, not too bad. He'll be able to continue, but he'll be in the back. So a tough break for all three of those guys. As we will restart with three laps to go. Logano still leading. Jeff Gordon does not get a good restart. Dale Jr. tries to take advantage. He makes contact with Logano. Hey, they head through two. Jr. to the lead. McMurray and Logano fall back a little bit. Jeff Gordon trying to take the second spot. Jeff Gordon going to dive it in now on Logano, and he'll be able to clear him for the second position as we have two laps to go. Dale Earnhardt Jr. has come out of nowhere to take the lead late in this one. Jeff Gordon and Joey Logano, though, trying to regroup and catch him. And now Matt Kenseth gets a little nudge there from Jimmy Johnson. He gets knocked out of the sixth position back to about ninth. As we're going to be coming around for the white flag, Jeff Gordon has closed up on Dale Jr. One lap to go. Jr. with the block. Gordon looking to the inside. Gives him a nudge. Logano is there. Here comes Jamie McMurray. They head on the back stretch. Gordon and Jr. Gordon's got the advantage. They head into three and four. Everyone's sliding around. Contact again. Jr.'s in the wall. Jeff Gordon's going to hold on and win race one of the Dudley Cup Series season six as an intense battle on the final lap between him and his teammate Dale Jr. along with Joey Logano and Jamie McMurray. It's Jeff Gordon that's going to pull out the victory in his last season of Double E Cup Series Racing. He wins at the Double E Speedway. So Jeff Gordon, his last win, his first win since season four, but it was a big one and it got this season off rolling good for him. Here are your top five finishes for the race. Winning was Jeff Gordon in the 24 car. Thank you to all of his sponsors. Second place was Joey Logano and you can see everyone there. Third today for was Jamie McMurray, and that's a good start for you know a young small team like that. Hopefully they can get this season off rolling. Fourth was Dale Earnhardt Jr. And fifth was Jimmy Johnson. And a strong day for Hendrick as three of their cars finished in the top five. Kane was caught up in a wreck, but still a good day for Hendrick Motorsports. Here are your total results. You can see AJ Allmendinger and uh, Austin Dillon finished seventh and sixth. That's a good start for the season for them. But anyone's race, anyone's season still. Even the guys that were caught up in wrecks, we got nine more races to go, so anybody can come back and make a big push for a championship. But Jeff Gordon definitely made the biggest impression today as he wins the first race of the season. 
Race 2 will be coming up in about in a couple of weeks. More information on that coming soon. Thank you for watching this afternoon. I hope you enjoyed the first race of Season 6, and I'll see you guys later.